Hi, Toby. Thanks for doing this. My pleasure. What do you think of this election? I think it's a it's a big election. Let's let's be honest. We've had the same government for a very long time, and it, it looks obviously that there's going to be a switch. Um, and uh, it's it's I feel more so than other elections. There's more talk about it. There's more interest in this election than than in, than in past elections. So you're one of the owners here. What is your sense? Do people talk about this in the, in the pub? It's not like the most obvious thing you would think is you're a big sports bar. It's football. It's hockey. Be any political talk? Well, you always, I mean, there's the old adage that uh, you shouldn't bring up politics right away, but obviously it creeps into conversation over a couple of beers. People are going to start talking about it. Like I said, it's such a big, it's a big deal right now, so people are talking about it. What is your feeling about how the election went in terms of not which party was doing well, but just the feel, the mood of the, the mood of people during this election? Well, I think the, what happened with with the parties being so negative against each other, it sort of it, it created sort of tension between between normal voters, you know, conservatives versus liberals versus NDP, and I feel like that that leaked into normal life. And then because of the, in, you see it all over Facebook. There was a lot of negativity going on. I think it wasn't wasn't the best election, uh, or the best uh, it wasn't the best election run up. Uh, it's unfortunate that it was so negative, but at least uh, at least now it's over tonight and we can uh, move on with ourselves. Well that's it, it's kind of enough's enough after two months. <laughs> yeah, well they were saying it is, it's the longest election, uh, longest we had to wait for election, 68 days or whatever it was. Uh, so it's, I mean it'd be good that it's over and we can move on and, and start, start the new Canada.